If you need to find the greatest common factor for 24 and 54, I'll show you how. So first off, the greatest common factor, that's also called the greatest common divisor or the highest common factor. I like greatest common factor. So what we do, we find the factors for 24 and 54, look at the common factors and then choose the greatest common factor. That's the GCF. So for 24, we end up with these as the factors of 24. For 54, let's see, we'd have 1 times 54, 2 times 27, that would equal 54. Turns out that 3 times 18, that gives us 54. And 6 times 9, that's 54 as well. So we have all of our factors. Now we're going to look at the common factors and then choose the greatest one. So 1, that goes into 24 and 54 evenly. 2, yeah. 3, that's a common factor as well. 4, we don't have that. How about 6? Six? 6 goes into 24 and 54 evenly. And it looks like that's the largest number that goes into both 24 and 54. So the GCF for 24 and 54 is 6. There are other ways you could do this, like prime factorization. But unless you have a big number, this works pretty well. This is Dr. B, and thanks for watching.